when he was nine, turning 10, he promised his father he'd win the World Cup. At 15, he was a pro. By 17, a vet. Adept at putting the ball in the back of the net. Went from mango kid to man on the go. Became a Brazilian national treasure, internationally known. Cool and smooth as a bossa nova groove. The truth? Ele é a personificação do samba. But we call him Ohei. The king had this mightiest thing about him. Everything he touched turned to gold. Turned a 10 year old's vow into a victory. Turned 10 into a household number as he turned the world upside down with a bicycle kick. Walking on air. But his domain was the grass. Man, was he fast on it. Passing the ball, he's past the opponent. A major component for more than just a moment in time. 58, 62, 70, heavenly, a testament. But hell bent on getting the benefits, setting the precedent. His presence was requested by queens, popes, presidents. His legacy evident, his legs I see were heaven sent. Feet like an angel's wings, worship like a god, with a trinity of trophies for his trinity of hearts. Tres corsos, tres copos del mundo. Then traded his mango for the big apple as the beautiful game came to America and grew. He planted new seeds but never forgot his roots. Who knew that boy from Bauru who grew up poor and without shoes that promised his father he'd win the World Cup and one day wind up winning the world? <laughs>